A frightening meeting with forest predators, an easy way of attracting a sea lion, kangaroo attack, and much more. It's Wild is with you. In this edition, you'll see the craziest cases when animals appeared from nowhere. We start with this interesting shot I received from my subscriber. He assures it was taken from the surveillance camera that captured a bear encounter. The man was apparently in a hurry and by accident bumped into a dumpster that awoke a bear sleeping inside. The animal went out to look at what was going on. When the man noticed the animal, he lost his tongue. Soon after that, he broke into a run with all his might. For sure, I would not like to find myself in this place. That's swell to encounter such a huge bear. Well, I don't know which meeting is the most insane. That one between the man and bear or this one between another man, his loyal dog and a huge moose. The host went for a walk with his four-legged friend. They approached their car and noticed a giant moose running toward them at full speed. The man tried to dodge the attack, whereas the dog started to defend himself and show aggression. That's surprising how much confidence the small creature had. The dog barked at the animal and gained time they needed at that moment. It was enough for him and his host to come back home safe and sound. Living in Australia means readiness for any situation. Even if landing on a paraglider from above you don't notice any predator in the vicinity, it doesn't mean to be safe. After all, some kangaroo police can approach you within seconds to hug you after hiding in the bushes all that time. Or was that an intruder whom they met this way? Did they do it to let him know that it was their territory and he had to go away? Why did the kangaroo react this way? Share your opinion in the comments. Raccoons are incredibly nice animals that seem to be completely harmless and pretty. Is it true? Spoiler, no, that's not the case. For example, they can encroach on your territory and start rooting through a dumpster until they find something tasty. If you dare to bother them, the animals will be pleased to attack or frighten you. Imagine how surprised the man from this video was when somebody jumped out of the dumpster at night. Judging by everything, the raccoons are used to eating in the evening. One day, they may be looking for something in a dumpster, whereas the following day, they may visit their old acquaintance from a local snack bar to have enough for supper. What's not to like? If you think to yourself, why do I need to feed anybody? Don't they have enough food in nature? Just watch this video. You'll understand that the animals may not be in a mood to tolerate your ultimatums. The snake from this clip was waiting for a girl coming back. When the girl opened the car door, the crawler tried to coil her just around the neck. Despite a mistake in its calculations, the snake annoyed the girl a lot. Another one who can get on your nerves is the white bear. This polar giant is the main object of study for many scientists from all corners of the Earth. Another group of researchers arrived in the Arctic and started waiting for this beauty. Soon after that, it appeared on the horizon. However, that didn't calm down the group. The thing is that this animal approached closer and closer. As a result, the distance between the people and the animal became critical. Nobody from the expedition wanted to be attacked by the bear. What's interesting, they weren't worried for themselves but for the giant's health. After all, all the people had arms to defend themselves, whereas there was only one bear. Fortunately, the bear turned aside from the way the people, slipped down into the water, swam away to the neighboring iceberg, and made itself comfortable just to enjoy life. You must agree. White bears are very beautiful, right? However fine the polar bears were, the sea lions impressed me not less. They're also very graceful, beautiful, and kind. What's more, they're rather innocent, to the extent that people can tease them with fish. There again, when sea lions jump on board and find out that people cheat them, the animals will not beat around the bush and prefer to leave the liars. They have nothing to do there. The tourists from the following story decided to stay for a night in a tent near the sanctuary in Botswana. Since they came to the nature, it was also worth immersing themselves in the wildlife to the full as well. Except that they couldn't even think that in the morning, an incredible surprise in the face of two intruders would await them. Those were two lions licking the tent, collecting water from it. The tourists had to behave themselves as calm as possible, not attracting any attention. After all, if they had bothered the predators or, what's even worse, frightened them, their reaction could have been deadly for the people. Fortunately, everything worked out fine and nobody suffered. You know, I've never thought about that before. 
Anyway, work in the forest is something incredibly dangerous. It's not enough that a lot of small and dangerous creatures live there. What's more, there's a great quantity of branches around. The chances are that you stumble upon a bear decides to visit you there. A bear climbed the tree as if observing the territory and checking whether people do their job right. The men reacted instantaneously. They were shocked that the bear went that far. Fortunately, nobody suffered. The bear was possibly satisfied that day. The next video is dedicated to three creatures, the man, alligator, and fish. You know who of them was a predator. The alligator had to decide whom he'd rather have eaten for dinner. Was it a man, some more difficult but at the same time more solid prey, or fish? Whom do you think he chose? I was shocked at the moment when the alligator passed by the fish and continued its way towards the man. Don't worry, there will be no screamer or severe battle. The predator passed by several meters more, lay down on his stomach and left the man safe and sound. Later on, the animal went back to the fish and ate it at one stroke. This situation happened to one of the islands where two girls were on vacation. They were going to take a boat they had rented. However, their travel was suspended by a curious guest. As you can see, I'm talking about this nicest monkey. It approached the girls, examined them and the boat, then it looked at what was inside and jumped aboard. Supposedly, the primate liked the transport, but it didn't want to travel in the company of the girls. Either the animal was busy at home or it didn't trust people. However, this unexpected meeting provided everybody with good feelings. I used to think those are only girls that are afraid of rats. It turns out that men are not less scared of meeting them. This man noticed this tailed friend at his home by accident and reacted as if it were not a small rat but a huge lion. It feels like the man frightened the poor animal by his reaction and made it to disappear. Maybe it was a special plan so that the rodent never finds its place at his home. In this case, it was clever. Whales are delightful creatures that surprise not only by their sizes, but smartness as well. Everybody who met them at least once told about how clever and kind they were. This video serves as an evidence to these rumors. It shows a giant animal swimming close to people, welcoming them and slightly swinging the boat. That happened during another outing. At the same time, the whale allowed them to caress its body and behaved utterly calm. There is such a feeling that the giants themselves like meeting people. It turns out that whales can be met not only far away from the shore, but right in the port as well. By the mooring in Alaska, a man noticed some kind of strange movement on the water and began to peer into the depth. In a matter of seconds, a real whale appeared nobody expected to see there. It was a delightful spectacle. It seems to me that the whale from the previous video could have found itself off the coast to learn the local prices for a haircut. The thing is that only one master was working in the depth. It charged a lot. I'm talking about that underwater seal hairdresser that was pleased to process this diver's head. By the way, did you know that seals can regulate their temperature? Fat layers isolate their body, whereas blood circulation system diverges the blood flow to the limbs and outside surface. As a result, seals can go to the ice, not melting it. Their thick fur protects them against the cold and holds the water on the skin that's heated to the body temperature. They regulate the process by changing the sun position and activity level, moving to the humid places or shallow pools. The man from the next video decided to show off in front of his friends and prove that he could control a bison. Spoiler, he didn't manage to do that. He was about to be seriously injured instead. Fortunately for the adventurist, everything worked out fine. It's interesting what the man was thinking about. Did he really think that the bison would get frightened and run away from the road? This is near to delirium. I fail to understand what happened in the next video. Was it either a duck meeting or something else? Dozens or even hundreds of ducks gathered together and were running along the way. It's quite possible that they wanted to cross the road, but people and cars prevented them from doing so. That's why the jam formed. According to what the author of the clip told, everything was solved and the ducks calmly continued their way. Anyway, it's better to talk about harmless ducks when they're crossing the way. You're sure to notice them and everything will be right. But if a snake comes into play, the situation will instantaneously change for the worse. In this video, a man shot the crawler confidently and quietly climbing the house roof. What for? Only the snake itself knows. 
Either the crawler wanted to look at the beautiful forest from above or find a tasty and appetizing prey. Sea lions are striking creatures. They can do such things that truly defy imagination. For example, the sea lion got out of the sea and climbed a stone stair. It plunged into the pool, swam along with a flare, and lay down on the deck chair. Then the animal displaced a man, saying it was its turn, and started to sunbathe on the sun. Who else can do anything similar? Here's a larger sea lion heading out for its job. Where exactly it was running to and what it was going to do? I don't know. With regard to the previous video, it can be anything. You can write your versions in the comments. It'll be interesting to read them. You know, I admire the nature and the animal world in particular. The alligator can be both aggressive and dangerous at the same time. The alligator can be both aggressive and dangerous, and at the same time, the animal can walk along the field next to ducks and people not even touching anybody. How's that possible? After all, that's a dangerous predator. I may not understand anything fully. The man from the following video was sitting in his room and working at his computer. There were complaints about his productivity. That's why the direction was forced to send their main agent to find him to find out the reason. Talking about a squirrel that got into the worker's flat to assess his advances. What was next? See for yourself. I think the squirrel at least will have something to say about the man's lack of stress resistance. Have you ever seen bears in person? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching and see you later.